Okay, welcome to part six, which we're calling Kaizen Applications. So when you think of the term line design, what probably comes to mind is a new line design project. And this could be a greenfield project on a brand new production line, or a, what we call a brownfield redesign of an existing production line. But let's face it, these opportunities, either one, don't come along very often. So the chance to apply mixed model line design methods and skills might seem to be pretty limited. But I want to disavow you of that idea by opening your eyes to the limitless potential of applying mixed model to Kaizen or continuous improvement projects, which hopefully are going on all the time in your company. OK, so you don't have a major line design project on the calendar, but your existing production environment can always be improved, right? Right? So here's an idea. Start with the process closest to the customer and create a future state design based on mixed model principles. So you can still use the same methodology, but just apply it to that one process. Now, why start at the end? Well, because when you're done, this new process is going to really flow. And you don't want to put it behind a process that doesn't flow as well and which is not balanced. So your new process is a racehorse. So don't put the racehorse behind the donkey. So once you have a paper design of the future state, go ahead and document the current state using value stream mapping or simply create a deployment plan. And then you can schedule the implementation as a Kaizen event or a series of Kaizen events if you need that. And once you've completed this first project and process, then move upstream and do the next one. So as we say, rinse and repeat. This structured approach to Kaizen has a lot going for it compared to the traditional approach using value stream mapping to identify Kaizen bursts or improvement projects. The problem with the traditional approach, if there is such a thing as traditional in Lean, is that improvements are not based on an ideal future state, but rather on Lean philosophical goals like elimination of waste. Which is better, making home improvements? Let's, let's, let's imagine you're improving your house. Which is better, making home improvements based on a to-do list of items that you want to work on, or making home improvements based on a carefully thought through design created by a competent architect? Well, I think most of you would vote for the second choice, and chances are better that you'll end up with a great result in your home. Same thing in a factory. So we did an hour long webinar on this subject recently. So if you'd like to learn more about using the mixed model line design method for Kaizen events, you can find a link on the right side of this page to view the full video.